Hello, good afternoon to you. Time now for business. Some good news for commercial banks that are struggling to meet the December deadline to meet the new capital requirement. Sources say the regulator could start enforcing the new requirement levels by the first quarter of 2019. We have the details in this report. It was initially believed that if banks failed to meet the requirements by the end of this year, they could lose their license just after December 31. However, sources close to the regulator say they will start reviewing the financials of these banks by the end of the first quarter of 2019. This is because the actual stated capital would be known or captured in the 2019 first quarter numbers. However, Joy Business is learning that in order not to be taken by surprise, the governor of the Bank of Ghana would by middle of this year carry out its own detailed assessment of the recapitalization plan submitted by the banks to ensure that by the end of 2018 they would have met the 400 million city capital requirement which some banks say they have already met now officials of the ghana revenue authority gra today stormed the premises of the north industrial area branch of melcom in accra to remove all products that have not been affixed with tax stamps. The operation is part of the enforcement process for the excise tax stamp policy which started last month. Some of the products taken off include alcoholic and non-alcoholic beverages. According to the Head of Education and Public Affairs at the GRA, Bubiansa, the exercise aims at ensuring that only products affixed with the tax stamps are found on the market. The GRA team is on a tour of some retail outlets in parts of Accra bring you some more details on this particular development on the marketplace which comes up shortly at one o'clock. My name is Imano Abuaji. We are free. That's it for business. Have a good afternoon.